Hello and welcome to Poseidon Tech. In today's episode, I will show you how to assign a static IP address to your Home Assistant and how to enable remote access using Home Assistant Cloud. So, let's start. First, go to Configuration, Info, and be sure that you have the latest version of Home Assistant. Click on Supervisor, System, and from Host System Card, click on Change the Network. Select IP version 4 and change the selection from DHCP to Static. Give an IP address according to your network settings. Click on Save. You can now close this window. Let's try the new IP address. That's great! Now it's time to speak about remote access. There are a couple of ways to access your Home Assistant remotely, such as port forwarding, which in my opinion is a security risk and must be avoided. Instead, you can use VPN, Virtual Private Network. If your router supports VPN, Create a VPN connection and let me show you how easy it is to use it. Go to your mobile settings, enable VPN, and then you can access your home assistant from anywhere, like you were in your home. Now, if you don't know how to configure a VPN connection or your router doesn't support VPN, then the solution is cloud access. Home Assistant Cloud is a subscription service provided by Nabucasa. Nabucasa was founded by the founders of Home Assistant, and by selecting this cloud service, not only you can support the Home Assistant community, but you can connect your Home Assistant with Google Home and Amazon Alexa. There is a free month trial, so let's start. Go to Configuration and Home Assistant Cloud. Click on Start your free one-month trial. Create an account. Click on Start Trial. You will receive a confirmation mail like this one. Click on Confirm Email. My account has been activated, so let's go back to Home Assistant. Final step is to enable Remote Control and restart server. To access now your Home Assistant remotely, go to nabucasa.com and log in with your account. From Remote UI card, click on Connect. Remote access is working great. Let's try also the mobile app. As you can see, I am connected locally to my Wi-Fi. And of course, Home Assistant is working. I will now disconnect from my Wi-Fi. As you can see, I am connected with mobile data. I will refresh Home Assistant. Everything is working. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next episode. If you like our tutorials, support our channel by clicking the subscribe button. Like and share our videos. And if our tutorials help you to grow your business, become a true member of Poseidon Tech by clicking the join button. If you want to learn more about our services, visit our website.